are beginning this afternoon with breaking news on congestion pricing and the controversial plan is now back. Governor Hochul is expected to make the announcement tomorrow, but with some changes to the cost of the toll. That's right. Eyewitness News anchor Tanya Rivera in the newsroom with the very latest. Tanya. Well, that's right, David. Congestion pricing is a go. Governor Kathy Hochul expected to unpause the program and unveil the plan tomorrow around 1 o'clock with a base toll of $9 for passenger cars. Now, the new program could launch by midnight December 29th. The MTA board still has to vote to approve this new lower rate. That vote will take place on November 18th because you may recall the MTA has been banking on the revenue from a $15 toll to finance both basic upkeep and large projects like the next phase of the 2nd Avenue subway. The governor has promised to find alternate funding sources to get the MTA the additional revenue it had been counting on. Now, Governor Hochul is making this announcement the day before a Friday court challenge challenge to the congestion pricing pause in lower Manhattan. The court case was brought by environmental groups, transit advocates and city controller Brad Lander. And earlier today, a letter from Representative Mike Lawler and others went out asking for help from incoming President Donald Trump to stop the implementation of congestion pricing. So you can expect that group to also seek a temporary restraining order to block implementation. Now, you may recall supporters of congestion pricing had been pressuring the governor to act quickly since we know that President-elect Trump has signaled his disapproval, but transit advocates say he will have a harder time ending congestion pricing once it has already begun.